hello once again, and this is Bubble Bubble for the Amstrad CPC. Um, just done the Commodore 64 version. I thought I'd give the Amstrad version a go. Um, yeah, one one of them games I really liked, to be honest with you. So hit fire, and right, one or two players, or R to refund the keys. I think we'll refund the keys. So let's have Q, O, P, and space, I think. Good selection of keys, there's no down key. Okay, that's fine. Um, so let's play the game and... Ah, oh, graphics, mm, not as good as the Commodore 64 version. Um, yeah, well, if I right, weren't that enthusiastic with the Commodore 64 version, this really does not actually stand a chance. Um, fucking hell. Um, I have to say... There was music on the Commodore 64 version. Um, there was a lot more going on with the Commodore 64 versions, to be honest with you. So, obviously, this was a rush job on the Amstrad. Um, at least there's colour, so you can't really say it's a spectrum pool. Um, so, it could have made it better. But once again, which I've had a, with a lot of Amstrad experience with gaming. A lot of them usually were fucking spectrum ports, or they just couldn't be bothered. And this is, looks like one of them. Um, and what makes it worse, I can't really be bothered with the game anyway. Um, it's just one of these games that did not grip me. Um, you know, I played some fantastic games on the Amstrad. That's why I owned Amstrad in the first place. Um, well, it wasn't. My parents bought me it. But there was a lot of good games on the Amstrad. And unfortunately, this wasn't one of them. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.